Welcome to Awesome Academy. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will write a socket program in Python to send and receive a file, text file. So first I'm going to write a program to send file. I'm going to import socket module. And then going to use one connection only to set to true you can set this to false if you wish to continue a set connections instead of just one I will save it as a send file. Now I'm going to set a file name that we want to send. It will be file.txt. And now a port for our service. socket we are going to create socket by using sockets modules method socket and now I'm going to get the local machine name that will be saved in our host variable and now we are going to bind to the port socket dot bind and we need our host and our port. And now we are going to wait for client connection. Socket listens. And for we are going to wait at least 10 seconds. And print some message. So we're started. and establish connection with the client and that will be our connection our res is set to socket accept and going to print uh, address using printf and our wrap string Accepted connection from our address. And then we get some data connection dot receive and bytes zero to four. Then I'm going to print server receive server received data. So we are getting the connection from our client to whom we are going to send our file. So we get and now I'm going to use with open open a file name we are going to open the file that we want to send to and it is open in a read binary mode and as file and get the data 
data by using file dot read method and number of bytes and then I'm going to use while while we have data we are going to send to our client send data and send that data to our, our client and then we are going to do print file send complete close the connection connection dot close and we are going to check that to make sure that the program doesn't hang while we test it so if we are going to do if one connection only Then we are going to shut down our socket by calling socket shutdown method and passing in one. It's an argument, and we are going to close our socket. And just going to save it. This is a uh, listen, not listen. Now we can just run our server. We don't have a client yet, but we are just going to check that our server starts. Yeah, we got this message file server started. Now we need to clear, create our client to read the file. And also I'm going to create a text file, which I'm going to send. I will have a text file and save it as a file.txt I just have this simple file I'm just gonna save it now I will have another uh, file, file for our Python script which will read that file and I will name it now in uh, this read file I'm going to import socket module and create a socket object sock the calling sockets socket method and get local machine name that will be our host socket uh, get host name and our port so one to one it where our server is listening and we are going to connect sock connect and policy in our host and a port and we are going to send some message to our server for binary data hello from client and now I'm going to use web open received 
file. This is our receipt file. Or I will name it in file. Read file dot txt. We are going to use right in binary mode. So we are going to save the data to this file as file. And then I'm going to use print file open. set to true so we will keep on reading until we get the data from the server the whole file and saving data sort dot receive and pass in the bytes and then we are going to print our hash string data and print out the data And we are going to check if not data, we don't have any data, we are going to break out of loop. Else we are going to write if the break. Okay. File dot write. Write data to a file. And at the end, just need to print. Print. Got the file. Uh, or file read complete, whatever you want to print a message. And then we are going to close the socket and print connection is closed. And just going to save it. We don't need a column over here after the break. First I'm going to run a send file to start our file server. Then I'm going to start our read file. There is n missing over here in our send file. It's printf and no f over here, it's inside. I will use terminal so you can see clearly. So I'm going to use Python 3 and send file.py to run our server. That port was open, I just closed that port and started again. So our file server started. So I'm going to open another tab and here I'm going to start our client. Python 3 read file dot py and you can see it printed receiving data and this is the data and got the file and connection is closed and we need to do cat and what was the file name file name is read file dot txt when I do cat to read file.txt and here is the content so we got the file so this way you can transfer file with the sockets using in Python to keep on learning please subscribe to my YouTube channel awesome Academy
kids for me and thank you for watching